Renault marketers logically wrote us down in third world countries, for which the can do sold in Europe turned out to be a little expensive. And it's true, we understand and are closer to a car on a modernized VO platform. And the genetics of Logan, the sacred cow of the domestic market, may shake the buyer. In a word, Docker was fashioned from a Dacia Logi minivan, production was set up in Casablanca and two versions of the car began to be delivered to us, a passenger one with windows and a rear sofa and a cargo one, Docker van, with two front seats and a 3.9 cubic meter cargo compartment. Only two engines were brought to Russia, a gasoline aspirated K7M 1.6 with 82 horsepower and diesel K9K in 90 horses. Both are offered with a non-alternative five-speed mechanics. The car, even in a packaged form, at the present time looks like a simpleton, which in our case is not critical. From the luxury noticed air conditioning, electrically heated windshield and mirrors, ESP, power windows, rear parking sensors, and a simple multimedia system, an analog of which can be found in Lada Besta. Alloy wheels, an option for 10,000 rubles. You can get by with simple caps. A sliding side door, by the way, is also an option. So long. The driver's seat does not shine with special comfort, but is generally comfortable. Passenger seat easy seat for the necessary transformation of a completely different design. It is flatter, without lateral support. But in the cabin there are many niches and containers for everything that may be needed in the work. Inside, it is loud and loud, the empty body regularly resonates all sounds. Suspension. The suspension was unexpectedly stiffer than usual, but the body is not goat. The only thing is that at high speed the car starts to scour a little, you have to taxi. However, you will still like the steering wheel, Logan will envy this, light and understandable. It is driven by an electric power steering and copes perfectly. Not to say that spending the whole day in the driver's seat will be a pleasure. The armrest between the seats is missing, fatigue is felt, but such are the laws of the genre. I had to learn how to maneuver without windows and a saloon rear view mirror. It is not simple. Add fuel to the fireside mirrors, which could be more. If we talk about diesel consumption, then there is a complete delight. Less than 7L slash 100km in the city. True, no download. And as a result, we have a simple but solid truck that uses its own dimensions to the maximum, does not hang out at traffic lights and does not annoy the driver with special inconveniences. And everything would be fine but 854,000 rubles for the basic version, like a wave on granite, break about 514,900, which are asked for an all-metal Lada Largus.